I should explain that I worked abroad for a long time, 17 years, the last 13 in Hong Kong with Hong Kong land, so that gave me experience in the property market. I came back in 1989, and by the early 1990s, I'd started my own property management company, managing the block of flats I lived in, and then landlords, or leaseholders actually, come along and said, well, they seem to think I was doing a reasonable job and asking me to manage their rental flat. So I did that for some years. And sometime during the early 90s, well, I had, as it were, an epiphany when one of the more elderly landlords, who was also a director of the company that, of the block I managed, said to me, uh, it was going well, and that was his pension plan. And of course, I knew the rent he was receiving per month, and I thought, well, actually, that's a lot more than the the state pension so perhaps I should try and buy properties and fortunately then property prices were, were in a bit of a dip and so I bought um, a, a, um, a studio flat, the cheapest you could possibly buy and that was the start. I have been um, living in London for just over 20 years, originally from New Zealand and I became a landlord about six years ago and I just saw the opportunity of um, going down the road of having some passive income. I was inspired to become a landlord back in 1998 for the simple reason that I could see my future, having been a freelance film editor for 40 years, being very, very broke. And the way at the time that looked the best, short of investing in shares, which I knew nothing of, property at that time, 1998, was the ultimate investment vehicle.